We are in Queens today. What the hell are we doing in Queens? We're buying a car. I'm really excited because it's gonna truly benefit my business. All the people that I work with are gonna be able to be chauffeured around so they can see properties more efficiently um, and make best use of their time. So I'm sitting here right now at Paragon Acura in Queens and we're picking up my Acura 2022 MDX. It's a three row with panoramic sunroof. So we're able to show clients not only usher them around, but then show them the buildings as we're passing through the city um, as more of like an educational thing. So I'm really excited about it and we're gonna do it right now. Good, yep, Okay. sounds now, good. Scroll down right here. That's your mileage allowance right here. 7,500 miles per year. I thought we did 10,000. 7,500 miles on that. Remember we talked about if you come back. That was 10,000. So I'm looking for 10,000 miles a year annually to, to drive the car. They had it at 7,500. We talked about that. It was a point that we had discussed. Um, I guess it didn't get <laughs> notified or updated in the contract. So they're going and changing that right now. Got to make sure that you read everything when you're looking at contracts. I do this for a career and for a living. So I'm very buttoned up when it comes to looking at contracts for myself. Make sure your information is correct. And then if yes, press the blue mm -hmm. button right there. The iPads, I'll tell ya. Technology. Technology, man, you try and make it easier and look what happens. It's because the camera's rolling. Yeah, it's what always Every happens. time the camera's when rolling. The ca when the camera's on, when the camera's going, you know what happens. The iPad's like, eh, we're gonna malfunction a little bit, oh, give you yeah. some time to talk to the camera. So I came here in an Uber, and I'm gonna leave here in a car. I've been Ubering for the last couple years, not couple, I mean, how long has Uber been around? Six, seven years? Taxis before that, trains mostly, so now, I'm gonna be sporting the Acura and I'm gonna have a driver. It's gonna be sick because I'm gonna be able to be all over the city like this. No more sweating. Registration in the mail. Yeah. You can go online to the DMV and kind of just customize them. Look at this car. This thing is badass. Right, I know. The inside, the interior red has everything on the side, even Woo! the panel. It is clean. Damn. <laughs> so I just got the car. Feeling good. Almost got in a car accident. 30 seconds after driving it. I guess there's like a, oh, here we go. Queens, I gotta get out of this borough. I'm fucking people are just popping out of nowhere. And this whole driving thing, I don't know. Gotta get a driver, next up driver. So I got this car for a couple reasons. One, Ryan is really pushing me. I'm also taking the sell it like Sirhan course. And in the course, they talk, Ryan talks about how his business exploded from an exponential standpoint because you got a car and a driver so for me you know i'm just trying to follow as much in ryan's footsteps as i possibly can so even though it's uncomfortable for me to get a car financially um, i'm stepping out of my comfort zone here and i'm really trying to do this so that my customers can have an outstanding experience by working with me for example oh here we go here we go I have a couple clients. One of them is a super high net worth guy. He's a CEO of a publicly traded company. And we looked at seven apartments the other day and we waited about four to five minutes for an Uber after every appointment. So if you add that up for somebody who's making um, millions and millions of dollars a year, five minutes times seven appointments, that's 35 minutes that I've wasted of his day and that can equate to millions of dollars for the clientele that I'm looking to do business with. So for me, um, as an agent who's dealing with high net worth folks, I wanna be able to deliver an unbelievable service and save them time. Because at the end of the day, time is all that we have. We have to make best use of our time. And I'm gonna do that for my clients because time is all that we have. People often trade uh, money for time. So what I'm trying to do with this with this car purchase is very, very simple. I bought the car so that I could save my clients time and be more efficient with my own time to close more deals and sell more real estate. That's why I'm doing this. All right, 
what happened? So we just hit a dead end. We we're trying to get a dope shot, you know, for some B-roll, and we are literally stuck. And I just blew through a cop, by the way. So, oh, I blew by a cop. So we're just backing up. Um, yeah, slow and <laughs> steady, I guess. Very treacherous. All right. You know what? I'm fucking going for it, bro. <laughs> this is gonna get too crazy if I don't. Ooh. Oh, what? Yeah. You good? Nah, they, it's the <laughs> auto stop. It said that there was an object approaching. I'm really testing my three-point uh, turn skills out with this thing right now. And I'm pretty pretty much failing. That's why I need a driver. Okay, we need a driver here, a stat. There we go. Uh, Where the hell are we? And if you haven't hit that notification bell yet, bang that too, alright? I'll catch you later and I hope to take you around and show you some properties in this car. 